Ta-dam, ta-da-da-dam. Hey, welcome. Why I feel now like this is my first video ever? <laughs> but yeah, hi, hello. <laughs> right, so you can see I have a lot of boxes here. Today is the boxes day <laughs> for me. Okay, I have this set. Simtop acrylic markers from the Artex company. But this happens because I won a giveaway they hosted on Instagram and I won the third place. And on the right side, I have this power adapter. Then case, cell phone case for, yes, iPhone 15 Pro Max. And I have this beauty here, which I'm going to unbox it. So I will start with the tech later on. First thing first, I'm going to unbox the markers. I wanna show you the Instagram post from Artex. Congrats to the winners of Artex Winter Wonderland drawing contest. Please DM your emails. And then you can see all the places, the first place, second and the third, which is me over there, yay. <laughs> and then you can see here the first place prize, the second place and the third one. And I got the third one, but I'm happy I got the third one because I wanted for so long to get these markers, but I actually never had the chance. So all this happens thanks to Artex for hosting this beautiful and amazing contest. If you don't know who they are, please check my video description. I will leave some links there and you can go check their shop, Instagram, social media and you will see. They have a lot of amazing art supplies. Now, while unboxing, can we just appreciate and admire this beautiful packaging? I mean, just look at this color combo and how aesthetic it looks. I just love it. <laughs> I think Artex made a great job while uh, designing this box. And I like the way how you open it. And here they are. Just look at them. 24 saturated colors. They, um, they look amazing, guys. They look really amazing. So let's have a close-up look to the markers. You can see here, uh, you can see the ink through the barrel, so you know how much is left. And you have the color code, so you know what color you use. And also you can have them on the back of the box. So this is the brush tip. We have brush tip and it has a nice mechanism. We need to push so the ink will come. Now I will uh, swatch them in my sketchbook, of course, because we need to see how they look on the paper. And I'm going to do it in order, like I can see here on the box. I want to start from the lightest color and go from there. And now, like I said, we need to push. This is the first color, the white. And yeah, it took me a while and then give a good shake. <laughs> we need to shake them. And yeah, the ink must come. I need to show you more closer. Can you see? Can you see? <laughs> okay, so they are waterproof, sunproof, and the same strong covering. Okay, let's move on to the second one. I always had a look on the box just to see which one, uh, it's, uh, which one is the next. And we have this one, like a yellow, pale yellow, cream, I don't know. Oh, have you seen? Ooh, <laughs> so satisfying. <laughs> The ink just came. So when you push, the ink is coming. This color is so pretty. Looks like a good skin tone to me. Let's see, let's see, good shake. And then ink is coming. This is so satisfying, Artex. <laughs> if you watch this video, this is so, so satisfying. Well done for designing these markers. And the colors are so vibrant, so saturated. So I, like I said, I'm going to write the codes and then I start swatching them all. Let's see. So I did one by one and 
because it took me so long to shake them all and make the ink coming i did this outside of camera and now i am able to swatch them and and move quickly with the video because otherwise this video will be so so long And these are the colors, 24 beautiful colors. What do you think? I think they look amazing. Let's test the blending. Okay, while I'm doing the blending, you can see they blend really well. I was surprised, really impressed. So you can blend them so nicely. And now we need to test the white to see how it looks over the black, but let's leave the black drying and make a doodle. Right, in my head I really wanted to make a flamingo and it came out something like this. <laughs> I, I hate it, okay? <laughs> Maybe in my head, because I didn't have a reference photo, maybe my brain was saying this is how a flamingo looks like. So it's just my brain, put the blame on that, okay? <laughs> okay, so you can see the white is not really white on top of the black, so with few coats it's working. So you need to um, keep layering. And then let's write the artic's name. And I think we are done with doodling and testing these markers. <music> Okay, I know you were waiting. Let's do the other unboxing. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Mm -hmm. iPhone 15 Pro Max. So satisfying. Ooh. And ta-da! Titanium white. Yes, this is the color I chose. Well, maybe you would ask, but why a new phone? Why? Hey, I'm telling you. This is so pretty actually. Oh, oh my god, this is so pretty. Looks amazing, guys. So maybe you are wondering why another phone? Because I already film and record videos with my iPhone 13 Pro Max. Well, I'm telling you in a second. So after I finished all the settings, I had to keep continue doing the unboxing. Oh, sorry, I forgot to record the unboxing of these ones. I forgot, I mean, to turn on the recording button. <laughs> but I can show you what is left. And okay, the most weighted one, the case, which we need to decorating it so pretty so clear and and we need to customize it in my way i started with um, this color which was i mean yeah close up to the packaging the the markers packaging i tried to stick to the, that color palette <laughs> but uh, yeah they are slightly different it doesn't matter looks really really cool to me I applied more coats so that was the first coat and then I moved on to the second coat and I was just keep layering until I was happy with the result I wanted to be more opaque and now I grabbed a mechanical pencil and I started to do a sketch and to be honest I didn't expect the pencil to work really well on uh, on top of these markers but you can see so yeah the reason I got this new iPhone is because I needed one and all the time when I was recording for example a long video for my channel I wanted to do in the same time a short video I mean with both in the same time so yeah that this is the main reason I I got this new iPhone 
but uh, any new phone comes with a new case so i really wanted to customize my case with these markers that i just uh, won you can see the skin tone is a light color so i had to layer a few times in order to achieve that opacity and i did the same for everything like for hair for clothes for the flower crown her flower bouquet and i know it looks weird now and you might not gonna like it how it looks at this moment but i'm telling you trust me it's going to look well in the end when everything will come together so what inspired me to draw this character is the spring coming so because the spring is here i said myself i need to express all this with a drawing and a character holding flowers wearing a flower crown and bringing this uh, spring vibe i also have seen in some areas uh, some snowdrops so i feel so good which confirmed the spring is here these markers, I want to talk a little bit about them. Well, it was easy to use them, to draw with them. I like this idea to push in order to get the ink and the brush nib. Oh my God, that makes a big difference. I love it. I love it. So Artex, they do have good products. I really enjoyed using them and I feel so lucky for winning that giveaway. I'm so, so happy now i think our drawing came a little bit better you can see some outline there i used a fine liner and also i was surprised it worked well on top of the acrylic marker by the way i want to tell you that my sketchbook is almost done so next week i think we'll do a sketchbook tour <laughs> my first ever sketchbook tour are you ready for that let me know in the comments also if you don't follow me on instagram i wait for you over there as well because i i will start making some exclusive posts only for instagram so yeah why not if you have an insta account come and join me there the hair to this character it was the most satisfying part for me i just love it i love this idea to not have outline for the hair so it was so satisfying layering those colors i did enjoy and then as a final i used the white gel pen I am done this is the final result what do you think do you like it tell me you like it let me show you more closer I think these Artex markers worked really well on this case and now let's see how it fits on the iPhone it fits really good as I expected I haven't done the borders, I wanted to stick only for this big part of the case. And that's it, I will apply I think a coat of varnish just to protect the markers. I will 
start packing them, cleaning my desk while still chatting a little bit with you. So he's saying here creativity is the soul's paintbrush. What a nice coat. So yeah, you can see I tried to match the colors from the packaging to the case, but I didn't have that red color, a specific red color and that green. Oh, on this one, I like how you tie the box. Really creative. Artex did a really good job with this uh, set. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, for being here, for subscribing if you are new. And I will see you in my next video. Oh, let me show you again. One more time, okay? I'm, I'm going. I'm going. Bye!